The story I'm going to tell you is about the park and it's about time. It's about the fact that time always turns in a wheel of the year again and again and again and again and again and again. So you've got spring, which is like this, and spring turns to summer, which is like this, and summer turns to autumn, which is like this, and autumn turns to winter, which is like this, and winter turns to spring, spring that's right, which is like this, and then spring turns to summer, and summer turns to autumn, autumn and autumn turns to winter. Again and again and again. It's the wheel of the year, beginning, never ending, always spinning. And we're in the wheel of the year and it's always turning. So you can go like this. Let me just. It's not end of the world, is it? No, no, it's the wheel. It's the wheel. Because, are you ready with spring? And spring turns to summer and summer turns to autumn and autumn turns to winter it can be cold like this and winter turns to spring it can be like spring beginning never ending the wheel can you make a wheel like this the wheel of the year is turning and returning let's take it for a spin and the thing is, is there's a lot of time. As you get older, you realise quite how much time there is. There's tons of it. Let's go back in time, about 70 years or so. Once upon a time, there was an old storyteller. I'm going to pretend to be the old storyteller by putting on this hat. I'm now the old storyteller. The old storyteller was really, really happy. He had a big smile on his face. Can I see you all smiling? He was really happy because he loved coming right here to Hyde Park. There was a Hyde Park here 70 years ago. And he loved to go around and look at all of the things. One of the things he loved more than anything else was seeing the birds. Let's have a guessing game. And guess what bird this is. What's that? Yeah, it is. You're right. It's a, a duck. You can pretend to... Yeah, you can pretend to be a duck by putting your wings like this. Can you make a quack like this? Quack, 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 quack. Now there's another bird that the storyteller really, really liked. I'm going to pretend to be it. See if you can guess what it is. Yeah, that's right. Here's a cuddly pigeon. Cuddly pigeon, everybody. Now, there have been pigeons in cities ever since there's been cities and ever since people have been writing down... No, it's a pretend, it's a pretend one. Ever since people have been writing down writing anyway, they've been writing about chickens and chi um, pigeons. And pigeons are very, very clever. They can recognise faces, apparently. Who knew? OK, I've got another bird that the storyteller... Can you hear that? What is it? Yeah. It's a red robin. You see the red robins? I oh, know, right? They are wonderful. You can see the red robins in the park. You see the red robins all over the British Isles. There are loads of them. Another thing that the storyteller really loved to do was he loved to go down to the Serpentine, the lake over there, and go for a swim. I'm going to pretend to go for a swim myself right now. Let me find my... Uh... OK, here we go. I've got my own serpentine right here. Okay, I'm swimming. <laughs> the old storyteller loved Hyde Park. The old storyteller loved swimming. The old storyteller loved the birds. And then the year 1952 happened. The year when underarm roll-on deodorant was invented. The year when the car uh, safety airbag was invented and the hovercraft and also, good catch, well done. And also the year when Elizabeth became queen. And the storyteller wanted to remember this. He came to the park and thought, what can I do to remember this? So I'll always remember this. And he was having a think. Can I see your thinking faces, everybody? thinking faces. What should I do? 
And then one of the birds turned up with this, an acorn. Can you all see the acorn, everybody? Now, acorns come from oak trees like this. And the old storyteller thought, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to plant this acorn and as the wheel of the year turns, I'll be able to see the acorn turn from a seed into a seedling, into a sapling and into a tree. And maybe it'll become a tree that people will tell stories underneath. And so the, uh, the storyteller got out a spade to dig a hole. Shall we all dig a hole? Yeah. This is the way we dig a hole, dig a hole, dig a hole. This is the way we dig a hole, a hole to put an acorn in. Let's put the acorn into the hole. Let's put the earth on top of the acorn. Let's pray, uh, let's pray for sunlight. Oh, can we have some sunlight? Um, I've got some sun here. Shall we get the sun out? Sit down, everybody. Sit down. Sit down, everybody. Here comes the sun, because you do need sun for things to grow. One, two, three. Here comes the sun. Put your hands up in the air to lift the sun high into the sky. Very good, everybody. Very, very good. And now it's time to have a little bit of uh, water to, uh, to water the acorn. Who would like to see the water go on me? Yeah. Would you like to see it go on me? Oh, okay. One, two, three. Oh, it went right in my face. Shall I do it again? Yeah. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, my goodness. And third time's the charm. Shall we do it one more time? Yeah. One two three oh now so the acorn can you show me an acorn the acorn was planted there had been sunshine and there had been rain and the storyteller waited and waited and waited and waited and spring turned to summer and summer turned to autumn and autumn turned to winter, and winter turned to spring. Beginning, never ending, the wheel of the year is turning and returning, and we take it for a spin. And finally, just a tiny little sapling came out, and it became a tree. And as the years turned, the tree got bigger and bigger and bigger, but it was still quite little. After around about 17 years, the tree was about this big or so. And just over there, where they're building uh, a place to have music, they had a big music concert. It was a free music concert for a band called the Rolling Stones. It's all right, that's why I've got it. I'll, I'll put it a little bit closer to me. A band called the Rolling Stones. And guess how many people came to the free concert? Have a guess, yes. Pardon? Zero. More than zero. More than zero. Yes. More than 400. Yes. How many do you think? More than four. More than five. Definitely more than five. Yes. That's a really good answer. We had an answer here of 100,000. More than 100,000. Yes. Um, very good answer. Less than a million. More than 2,000. Yes. Spot on. 500,000 people turned up in the park. And do you know what everybody was really worried about? Have a listen. 500,000 people turned up. Everybody was really worried about litter. Everybody was really worried about litter. If you drop things in the park, it's litter. You should put it into the bin. And everybody was really, really worried there was going to be too much litter in the park. And so we're on to the next bit. So what happened, what happened was the Rolling Stones said, if at the end you pick up your litter, if you pick up your litter, we'll give you a prize. So we're going to do some picking up of litter right now, just like the people did. This is pretend litter. Sit yourself down, sit yourself down. That's good. One, two, three. 
Can we please pick up all of the litter and put it into the bag? Let's put the litter into the bag. And it's that simple. If you see something on the ground, you pick it up and you put it in the bin. The wheel of the year kept on turning. So spring turns to summer and summer turns to autumn and autumn turns to winter and winter turns to spring. Beginning, never ending, the wheel of the year is turning and returning. Let's take it for a spin. And the wheel of the year turned until 1977. 1977 was the year of the Silver Jubilee. I was four. I was four. And everybody had parties. And I remember going to a party. They had a party right over there. It was a really, really big party. And the wheel of the year kept on turning. So shall we have spring turning into summer? and summer turning into autumn, and autumn turning into winter, and winter turning into spring. Beginning, never ending, the wheel of the year is turning and returning. Let's take it for a spin. Please sit down, please sit down. Can you sit down, please? Please sit down. Thank you so, so much. And the years kept on turning until we got to 1992, when there was a big wind. Can you hear this? It's the sound at the end, if you're very, very good. Sit yourself down, sit yourself down. You have, and you can have a go at the end if you're good. And you are being good, so that's a thumbs up. So, the wind was so strong that loads of trees in the park fell over. Can I have that back, please? Can I have that back, please? Thank you. Thank you very much. That's all right. All of four and a half thousand trees fell down in the park. So if you think that here, there's about 45 of us here. There's about 45 of us here. Are you all right? I'm so, where's your grown up? Where's your grown up? You get yourself some comfort and you'll feel better. So, if there's 45 of us all here, if you times that by 100, that's the number of trees which fell down in this park, but not the story tree. The story tree grew bigger and bigger and stronger. Every year, the trunk got a little bit wider and wider. The 1900s turned to the millennium, and then we got to now. We got to 2022, 70 years, 70 years, and the story tree we're under. This is it. This tree here is 70 years old. So at the beginning of the story, it was an acorn. That is what a 70 year old tree looks like. And we're under it. So there you go. The wheel of the year keeps turning. And the funny thing is, is so this isn't even one of the big trees in the park. If you look at this tree here, this tree's probably double the age. And what happens when this tree has got really, really old and they're looking to replace it? Well, would you believe it? There are people in the park who have got a super nursery where they're already growing trees, thinking ahead 102 years, 100, 200 years ahead of time for trees, to make sure that there's always going to be trees in the park. What you might think about doing if you keep coming to this park is to choose your own tree. If you choose your own tree, you can keep coming back to it every year or every few years and see how the tree grows. And you can see how the wheel of the year turns. Anyway, I thought it'd be nice to finish by singing the wheel of the year one more time. Have you got the spring? And spring turns to summer. Have you got summer? And summer turns to autumn. And autumn turns to winter. And winter turns to spring. Beginning, never ending. Have you got the wheel of the year? The wheel of the year is turning and returning. Let's take it for a spin. Well, I've had a lovely time 
telling you the story of the wheel of the year how 70 years is a really really long time enough time for a tree this big to grow